Today, I'm going to talk about the things that I have in my pencil case. I always take my pencil case with me when I go to class. It is always in my backpack. In my pencil case, I have three pencils. I use my pencils for drawing or writing. I like using pencils because I can use my rubber or eraser if I make a mistake. I also have four pens in my pencil case. I have one black pen, two blue pens, and one red pen. I usually use a blue pen to write and to do exercises, but I use a red pen to correct the exercises. When I do an exam, I use a blue pen or a black pen and the teacher uses a red pen to correct the exams. I have one rubber or eraser, as they say in the United States, to rub out or erase the mistakes that I have made when I was using a pencil. Then I have a ruler which I use to draw straight lines and measure. My ruler is made of plastic but there are also rulers that are made of metal. I don't really use my ruler often because in my classes we don't need to measure or draw straight lines usually but if you are studying a degree like mathematics, art or architecture for example they are necessary because you will use them a lot in your classes. I have one sharpener in my pencil case. I use my sharpener to sharpen my pencils. I usually use the sharpener to sharpen my colouring pencils because I have a set of 12 colouring pencils with all different colours. My favourite object in my pencil case are my highlighters. I use these a lot in my classes because I use them to mark the important information in my notes or in texts. I have a pack of five highlighters. They are yellow, orange, pink, purple and blue. Two things that I have in my pencil case that I don't normally use are my scissors which you can use to cut paper or other materials and a glue stick which is a small tube of glue. In my degree we don't do a lot of crafts we don't usually use scissors or glue sticks only when we are doing projects. In these projects we have a piece of card and we decorate it. 
So in this case, we do need some scissors and some glue, but we don't do this often. I also have some sticky notes in my pencil case. Sticky notes are small pieces of paper that have a bit of glue on the back and you can put them on different places. So for example, you can stick it in your book, on the wall, or on your computer screen. And I think this is a great idea when you are studying. If you need to learn a word and you can't remember the word, you can write it on a sticky note and you can put it on your desk or on your computer screen and then you will remember it. In my pencil case, I also have some paper clips which are small metal or plastic clips that you can put on a piece or some pieces of paper to keep them together. This is a great option to use to organise your papers or documents. Similarly, I have a stapler in my pencil case. A stapler has small pieces of metal inside that are called staples. And you can use a stapler to staple or put together two different pieces of paper. Finally, some things that I don't have in my pencil case are felt pens and crayons. I don't normally colour in my classes, so I don't have any of these colours in my pencil case, but I know that a lot of children take these to school because they spend a lot of time colouring in their classes, especially in their art classes. If you have enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. Thank you very much and I'll see you in the next video.